What's up, friends and besties? It's your girl, Sonya Lene, and I'm back with another video. All right, y'all. Today, somebody asked me how to pray, so I figured I'd do a video on it because I remember when I needed to know this information. I remember when I was asking and I needed to be guided and for somebody to let me know how to petition God so that I can hear from him, number one, and so that, you know, he could answer my prayers because I needed my prayers answered, okay? <laughs> Anyway, some people may feel like I'm not qualified to share this information, but I don't care, okay? This question came from a specific person, so this video is for you and for others like you, okay? Anyway, um, yeah, before I get started, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up. Share it out to somebody. Let them know what we're doing over here at Sonya Lene TV. Also, subscribe to the channel. Okay, if you're watching this video and you have not subscribed and you, you know you've watched several other videos, baby, you're not going nowhere. You're going to keep on coming back. So go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notification bell. Turn it on all so you won't miss when I upload or when I go live, okay? And some people have been saying that they are not getting their notifications. So if you're not getting your notifications, I decided to invest in a little solution. Gonna try it out for about a month to see how it works. If it works, we're gonna keep using, okay? So go ahead and um, text my name, text Sonia to the number on the screen. That way you will be in the know, okay? Text my name, Sonia, to the number on the screen. That way you'll know when I do giveaways, go live, do special events and all that stuff because y'all know I likes to pop up, all right? All right, let's get into prayer, all right? The first thing I wanna say, the very, very first thing I would like to share about prayer and my thoughts on prayer is be yourself. Okay, don't try to be nobody else. Okay, I know that a lot of us grew up and we watch people pray and we think that prayer looks a certain way. It's supposed to sound a certain way. That's not all the way true, okay? Um, God already knows you, so you don't have to impress him. You don't have to sell him on your character. You don't have to sell him on your personality. God knows you because he created you, okay? So when you communicate with him, just be real, okay? Just be real, because that's all you can do, okay? You don't want to have fake prayers out, because he ain't going to pay you no attention. I mean, what, what? when a person know you being fake, all they can do is laugh at you, okay? So go ahead and be real. Be 100 with the Lord, okay? That way you can just get what you need to get from him, and he can get what he need to get from you, which is the praise, all right? Anyway... So that's the first thing, be yourself. The second thing you want to do, okay, is to thank him. Okay, God is responsible for us waking up every day, for us having the meals that we need to keep us fat. <laughs> God is responsible for us breathing, okay, for us having the things that we need and some of the things that we want. So what we want to do is we want to start our prayers off with a thank you, showing our gratitude for what we already have. A lot of times we have so many problems and we always go to God with our problems. But you got to think about it. If it was you, would you want somebody coming up to you asking you for something all the doggone time and not, kept, you know, thanking you for what you already done for them or, you know, just trying to see how you're doing? Okay? So, I mean, you got to think think about God. He cares for us. And I believe our God has feelings. So we want to make sure that we show our gratitude to him before we start asking for stuff, okay? <laughs> okay, so um, the next thing. Now we talked about prayer looking and sounding a certain way. You don't want to conform to what somebody else is doing, push somebody else's agenda, um, try to be somebody else, try to walk and talk and sound like somebody else. So what you want to do is you want to talk to God and, 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 and talk to him from your heart, okay? You want to speak to God from your heart. And whatever's in your heart, that's what you share with your Father in heaven, okay? So that way, you'll know that he's going to respond to you accordingly. You know what I'm saying? Like he can't respond to you 
from somebody else's prayer. It's got to be your prayer. God made us all in his image, but he made us all different too. Ain't no two people exactly the same. So there is always something so unique about you. And God wants to see that in you. God don't want you walking around here trying to be somebody else. Okay? Don't do it. Okay, when I go to God and I thank him, God, I thank you for another day. Because you ain't have to wake me up this morning, but you did. Okay, I thank you for the mercies that renew every morning. Because I'm always I'm always getting it wrong somehow. Okay, I'm always doing something I ain't supposed to be doing. I'm always saying something I ain't supposed to be saying. So God, forgive me for yesterday and thank you for giving me another day to get it right today. Okay, so that's, you know, you just want to go to him and just be 100. You want to go to him and be real. You don't want to go to God with all that fake stuff. Father, in the name of Jesus, Lord, we give you glory on today. God, we want to thank you for your omnipotentness. God, we, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's not real. It ain't real. Now, for some people, it may be real, but if it ain't real like that for you, if that's not what you do, if that's not how you communicate, think about how you communicate with everybody else. If you communicate with everybody else one way, and then you go to God all proper, he know you being fake because he created you, okay? So just go to God, you know, with respect, okay, because he's our heavenly father, all right? And just go to him and be 100, just be real, okay? That's all I can tell you about that. Now, another thing when it comes to prayer, some people feel like you ought to be on your knees when you pray, or you ought to be standing up when you pray, or you ought to be walking when you pray, or whatever. Listen, when you pray, whatever it is that you're doing at the time, if it's not affecting the way your mouth moves, then you can just go ahead and talk to the Lord, honey. Because God is going to be with you on your knees. Now, sometimes it's... It... All right, y'all. <laughs> y'all know I love the Lord, okay? But anyway, sometimes it's necessary to get down on your knees and pray. And you'll know when that time is. But God don't judge us like everybody else does. Okay, so when it comes to prayer, you want to just open up your mouth and communicate with God. Now, one of the things I like to do when it comes to prayer, because there I have scheduled prayer time. And also, the Bible tells us to pray without ceasing. So there are times when I just feel something in my spirit or God will drop somebody's name in my spirit. I'll think about one of y'all, honey, one of my besties or something like that. And I'll just start to pray for you because that's what I feel in that moment. Okay. We scroll through social media all the time. People asking for prayers on Facebook or whatever. That's a time for you to just go ahead and say a prayer. But you should always schedule some time. Give God some time. Some on purpose time. Okay. Always schedule some time with God. Mine's is in the morning because, I mean, I'm already in the bed. It's already quiet. My kids ain't bothering me. My husband ain't asking for nothing. You know what I'm saying? So you schedule time with God. You want to make sure that that time that you have with God is quiet time. Because you, like a lot of people, some people sing songs um, before they, you know, go into prayer. Uh, some people play uh, worship music before they go into prayer. Me, because I'm a singer and because I'm, a, you know, a musician, and I don't play music at all. I don't do nothing. I just be quiet. So I like for my time with God to be quiet time. Okay, so when I when I when I go into my quiet time, I just sit there for a little bit. Okay, and then it, everything that I need to say to God, it'll come to me because it's quiet, and I don't got you know, I don't I don't got to worry about nothing. Okay, so I'm in my quiet time, and I'm just breathing because you 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 need to you know get yourself clear your mind. Okay, because you don't want to go to God and you just sitting there you think about everything that's wrong in your life. No, don't do that. I need you to calm down. Okay, bring it all the way calm. And just be quiet. And let God speak to you. Let him speak to your heart. Let him hold you. Let him love on you. Okay? And when you do that, then you'll know exactly how to communicate with him. Okay? You let him lead. You let God lead. 
Because when God leads, then you know exactly how to follow. Okay? It ain't a whole lot of work to do when it comes to prayer. Just pray. Just talk to the Lord. Okay? Because he going to be there for you all the time. All right? Oh, that's prayer. That's prayer for me. Anything else y'all want to know about prayer, drop down in the comment section. Let me know. Let's talk about it. Um, What do you do in your prayer time? How do you meditate? How do you get prepared to speak to God? How do you um, allow God to speak to you? Do you play music? Huh? Do you sing songs? Because I grew up in a church where they would sing, I need thee, I need thee, oh, I need thee. Every hour, I need thee. You know what I'm saying? They would sing that before prayer. Everybody's on one, you know, everybody's singing. Okay? But me, I need quiet. I need nothing. I need, I, I just need to be able to breathe and then, you know, allow God to hold me because I'm a woman and I go through stuff, okay? And I deal with kids and I deal with a husband and, you know, my, my emotions be running high because I'm a woman, okay? <laughs> Sometimes my emotions be all kinds of messed up because I'm a woman. So when I get with God, I just want him to hold me and let me know everything's going to be all right and comfort me and let me know I can keep going. And so when I do that, then I know how to respond to him and I know how to talk to him. Prayers ain't nothing but a conversation. Okay, y'all? Don't be afraid to talk to God. He's your father. All right? If y'all have any more questions about prayer, let me know down in the comment section. Let me know how y'all feel about prayer. Let me know how you pray. Okay? Maybe we can help each other. Because, listen, I'm not an expert on this. I'm going to tell you that right now, honey. I struggle every day. Uh-huh. I get it wrong every day. That's why I thank God for his mercies in the morning. Because I get it wrong every day <laughs> it is what it is honey i'm real with myself so that's prayer okay anything else y'all want to know let me know i love y'all guys don't forget to subscribe to the channel okay don't forget to subscribe <laughs> and also don't forget to text my name to the number on the screen so that you can um be notified when I go live and also when I do giveaways and special events, okay? Um, I love y'all so much and until next time, bye!